episode three, episode three. Mm, get this one up. Game screen manager. And we're good. So, episode three. Hey, come speak with me. I don't want to speak to you. With something secret. I know you might want my help, but I don't want to speak to you right now because I am a merchant. Which means I chant to the merfolk. Alright, let's see. What sort of... Are we going to dress up the old ship today? Uh, let's have a look. Uh, Fit them beach comery. Sails of the Gilded Age. Oh, I like that. There is my beautiful baby. Woo! And <laughs> right, uh, for good luck, I need depression. Hey, depression! I love you. Ah, you're too cute. My beautiful little depression. I realized a long time ago. It brings me great luck to stroke my depression. You can sit right there because you're beautiful. Alright, I picked up a load of merchant quests last time, didn't I? A valuable shipment on the Devil's Roar. Embark on a cargo run from the perilous Devil's Roar on his Merchant Alliance voyage. Let's have a look then. We are hereby requested to collect five crates in the name of Alfric. On the roaring from the roaring traders. Is it Alfric? No, Elfric. Roaring traders. So be somewhere around here. Which is this should be interesting because I don't tend to go to the Devil's Roar. Ah, roaring traders. Oh, it's just a little sea post. That's handy. So, pretty much straight east. To east, depression. No, 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 no. Pixie, love a bit of depression. Depression's like the cutest. Pixie, would you like to stroke my depression? She is beautiful. But fickle. My depression is fickle, but but beautiful. Ah, oh, you want to stroke? Well, Pixie, you're gonna have to get on the game sometime, then. Aren't you? You're gonna have to get on, and join the crew, and then you can stroke depression. No, I don't want to go north. It's gonna be ever so slightly south. Do you want to see just how cute depression can be? I'm going to show you something and it's going to melt your heart. Are you ready? Not my clock. Are you ready? Dance, depression! Dance! <laughs> I know, I'm sorry, Pixie. I you know what, for a split moment I forgot that this game gives you motion sickness. My depression is so cute. Look, it has a heart of fire. I 
I feel like you need a better song. Uh, we need something jolly. Let's go with... Seek the Dead. Yeah, metal! <laughs> I think my goal as well with this stream, I'm not going to be as much of a chicken. I mean, if I get attacked by something, I'm just going to be like, don't abandon the vessel. Actually kill them. I know, Pixie. My depression is too adorable. I don't think there's anything as adorable as my depression. Let's check the old map. Probably adjust the sails so that I'm getting more speed if I can. No, I can't because the wind is going against me. Maybe I can actually a little bit. Might be able to pick up a little bit if I put it. No, not really. You never know. Winds might change. I close my eyes. Only for a moment, then the moment's gone. Why did that come in my head? How far away is it? It's... Well, there's my ship. What's that? Is that a Reapers? Yeah, it's just a Reapers. Here's my ship. I've got to go past Devil's Ridge, and the next thing I come across after that will be Roaring Traders. So, Pixie, I need to ask a big favour. Can you cross your fingers that I'm not going to have too much problem with the volcanoes? Enough of that. Okay. Right, I'm gonna. Oh, what's this? Uh, I don't. I don't even recognise that bit at all. Did you not usually go that way? No. You see, I tend. I tended to not go to Devil's Roar. Mainly because it can be a bit of a pain. And obviously, the people I used to play with. Didn't like going to Devil's Row. I don't mind it too much. I like the... Yep, I'm calling myself out now for the fact that I always feel the need to organise my uh, storage. Bioworks can go in the bottom. And then we're going to come over here. We'll have fruit in the top one, and meat I'll put in the bottom one. Yeah! Bum ba da dum ba da dum ba ba ba. Yeah, I don't, I don't tend to go to Devil's Roar, uh, because the quests I've been doing up to now on, like on stream, um, don't haven't been taking me to Devil's Roar. I I I kind of like Devil's Roar. I like the whole aesthetic with the volcanoes and stuff. It's just, it can be a little bit frustrating. Especially with the quests I'm doing. Because if I have bottles of rum on my boat, and then I get hit with some liquid hot magma, um, it could smash the bottles of rum. Did it 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 did
Oh, what do we do with a drunken sailor? What do we do with a drunken sailor? What do we do with a drunken sailor? Early in the morning. Put him in the longboat till he's sober. Put him in the longboat till he's sober. Put him in the longboat till he's sober. Early in the morning. Yo ho and up she rises. Yo ho and up she rises. Yo ho and up she rises. Early in the morning. I'm getting carried away. I'm feeling a little hyper this morning. I apologize to uh, to you, Pixie. You're gonna have to suffer me all day. <laughs> Yo ho and up she rises. Yo ho and up she rises. Yo ho and up she rises. Only in the morning. I'm not ignoring the chat. Have you changed your wheel? Yeah, I've gone with the beachcomber uh, ship because I actually really like the look. Come to think of it, I think every time I've... Uh, like this is the third stream now, but each stream I have been decorating my ship slightly different. Purely because... Oh, yay, I can drink some sick. Num, 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 num. Oh, my sick, yay, num, 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 num. Oh, tasty sick, num, 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 num. Stop it, it's making me ill. <laughs> Sick. Num, 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 num. <laughs> right, that's the last time. I won't do it again. I'll throw the sick overboard. Fish can eat it. La, 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 la. <sighs> oh no, I've got I've got a song in my head, but I can't sing it because it would irritate people. Sack it, I'll do it, it's my stream. I can do what I want. Super color fragilistic expialidocious. Even though the sound of it is sometimes quite atrocious. If you say it loud enough, you'll always sound precocious. Super color fragilistic expialidocious. I'm the little I'm the lie, I'm the little I'm the lie, I'm the little I'm the lie, I'm the little I'm the lie. Right, it's gone. It's out. I've got it out there. It's disappeared. It ain't coming back. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Right, I'm entering the Devil's Roar now. How far away am I? I need to start heading southeast ish. Well, east by southeast. That should. I should probably be able to see it soon. Be a little island. There we are. I believe that to be it. Which means I'm heading directly for it. I might change it up a bit this stream. And not just do merchants. Maybe do a little bit of order as well. Because obviously I need to level them up. What do you think, Pixie? Would you like to see a bit of Order of Souls in as well with the merchant? Yeah. Okay. I shall do that. For you. I'll bash out this Order of Souls mission. Uh, this. I'll bash out this uh, Schmeckelsy Beckelsy mission. Uh, I've got... Two order of souls, so I'll throw some order of souls in it. Mm 
Ping pong, ping pong, ping pong. Land ho! At least I hope there's one. It's lonely on these seas, you know. Well, I ain't seeing any smoke from volcanoes. Uh, it's got to be a good sign. I'm really rather hoping that I have to deliver different items, but I don't think I will have to. I think it's just going to be the same. As long as they don't give me pigging plants. Oh no, I'm a bit closer. Uh, damn it. That's a good start, isn't it? Susan, stop knocking holes in your ship! But no, I'm not going to abandon the ship. I want to look after the ship this time. First island I come to. Smash. Just playing Smash or Pass with ships. Oops. Oh, you can shut up with that. <laughs> it will be another episode of Between Two Firms. Firms? Firms. God damn it. <laughs> Straight away! The first item! God! <laughs> I mean, at least it's prettier than just plain green, but... Damn it! I'm waiting, I'm waiting, Pixie. I know you're going to come out with something. So I'll put this one on this side. Oh, I've shot it. Only one though, so it isn't an episode yet. <laughs> you just wait. <laughs> There's more. <laughs> I can guarantee it. It's gonna be another plant. Oh, okay, silk. I should be in an alright space. I'm not gonna be stupid this time. I'm gonna try my hardest to keep it dry. Dad. I bet you're happy now, aren't you, Pixie? I'm waiting. I'm waiting for it, Pixie. Is it, where's it going? Oh, God. Oh, God. The volcano right next to me is exploding. i got to be quick. just far enough away to get away with this. Run. Welcome back to Between Two Ferns. Today we are talk talking to Aunt Susan, who seems very happy to be uh, here today. I am happy. I'm always happy. Just a bit nervous about that volcano. Uh, more room. That's not too bad. Right, so far nothing's getting close enough to hit me, so I think I'm okay. I need to be quick though. I don't want to damage any of this room. I like how the room bottles are red. 
Does that mean it's a spy storm? Is that all of it? Yeah, that's all of it. Oh, made for it too soon. So there you go, Pixie. That's why the devils were always dangerous. Because you've got these volcanoes all over the place. Oh, that's actually getting kind of close. I might... Right, quick check where it is. Uh, read delivery note. Crooks Hollow. Oh, awesome! I don't have to stay in Devil's Row. Where's Crooks Hollow? Crooks Hollow. Oh, that's quite a way off. But I'm pretty sure I get more money for these ones. So, Northwest. Raise the anchor, run. Raise the anchor, run away from the volcano that's angry. Ma. Turn the wheel and raise it now, and we're going to go to Crook's Hollow. Because Crook's Hollow is where Wild Henry lives. Blar deep blue, blue, blar. We're going to the northwest. Northwest and bound. Moving away from a volcano, because I don't like the fire. Hum, hum. Oh, I don't like how there's a ship there. Oh, that's not good. Oh, bugger, bugger, bugger me timbers. Oh, am I going to be heading right for a storm? Oh, yo, ho, all hands, is your colors high? We are no longer between two ferns. We are now the Eurovision Song Contest and performing for the UK is Aunt Susan with Star 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 Beeb Blard. I forgot I was supposed to sort that out. Oh, Bum Bum. I'm not allowed to see Bum Bum. That's right, I went on the settings after the last stream and I was like, alright, oh, this is what I need to adjust. I'll do that before next stream. And then I saw a butterfly. And I was like, oh, it's a butterfly. And I followed the butterfly for 27 hours. It turned out it wasn't a butterfly. It was actually just a piece of lint blowing on the wind. What was my point? Where's that weird ship? Right, why is it sending me towards this weird looking ship? I'm pretty, pretty sure. Doesn't that symbolize somebody with a Reaper's flag? Or is that me just being an idiot? Oh, I'm not sure, because if it was a Reapers, then it would show up on the map. Why does my boat keep on turning without me holding it? Depression, is it you that's doing that? Well, I believe in miracles. Hi, Bob. You birdie thing. Birdie thing, you. You know how you've got moderator things? If you go onto it, there's a section you can go onto. But you could. I showed you. Oh, yeah. Let's 
So we're off to Crook's Hollow. And there's some sort of vessel apparently in our path. So I think probably best off getting those cannons loaded up. Just in case. Just as a deterrent. Just so I can preemptively strike. Why am I heading? Oh, it's probably, it'll be the wind. It's me, I'm being a moron. A moron is what I a be. A be 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 be. Yo ho, and up she raises yo ho, and up she raises yo ho, and up she raises early in the morning. Put him in a long boat till he's sober. Put him in a long boat till he's sober. Put him in a long boat till he's sober. Early in the morning. Put him in the bed with the captain's daughter. Put him in the bed with the captain's daughter. Put him in the bed with the captain's daughter. Early in the morning. Yo ho, and up she rises. Yo ho, and up she rises. Yo ho, and up she rises. Early in the morning. Well, these waters are nice and calm. That's quite pleasant. Uh, so how... Right, so after I pass Ancient Spire, just start heading west and I'll get to Crook's Hollow. And... Crook's Hollow... He'll be on the end of the pier right there. I'll get rid of that. Head west. Go west, because I'm going west. Go west, because I want to go west. Go west. West is where I'm going. Go west. Westy woosy west. I always like to overcurve my shots. Adam ba be di be di be da 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 de dum. Adam. Ba -de 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 -do. Blard! Depression. When you look into my eyes, I see nothing but love. You know, it's a good day when you look into your depression's eyes and your depression looks back and you feel loved. <laughs> All jokes aside, though, I really wish I had a bird. I, lo I love birds. And now that bird isn't a euphemism for anything. I'm a taken man. <laughs> I'd really love to, to have a falcon. Surely, because then I could partake in the act known as falconing, and I could be a falconer. And then if someone said, oh, where are you going? It's like, I'm just going to stroke my falcon. And they'd misread it, but I would literally be stroking my falcon. And myself. Because <laughs> I have a beard. I stroke my beard. There's no subtext there. Anyway, change the subject. Pixie, what do you think of my cannons? You like how long and shafty they are? You like how they're made of wood? Being as that would be a stupid idea to shoot a cannon out of because gunpowder in a cannon? Star, 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 star. What on earth did you type then? You can't. Right. What? <laughs> what 
When I stop at this island, I'm just going to take a quick second <laughs> just to see if I can jump on the settings and change that. Because I want to see that I stuff. That you can't... So, yeah, that says long wood. Yeah. I mean... I don't really have long wood. I've got, like, stubby cannons. <laughs> I mean, I suppose I've got a big, strong mast. But stubby cannons. <laughs> They're even, like, weird deformed cannons with the tip being more blown out. And anyone reads into that and sees something dirty, you've got a dirty mind. You should see what leaks out of these cannons though, it's amazing. It's these massive big cannonballs. Sometimes fire, which is kind of expected with a ginger. Yeah, I mean, I like the aesthetic of them, but they make absolutely no sense. Well, they'd just burn. Well, no, because, I mean, you can sort of treat wood, theoretically, can't you? I mean, there could be there could be a special resin on the inside. That's, that's fine. Because, you know, you've always got to lube up the inside of your cannon. when you're slipping in that big strong cannonball and the wadding don't forget about the wadding a bit like shawaddy waddy <laughs> did I just crash again did I actually damage the ship though Right, that was just a love tap, so that doesn't count as damage. Okay, that counts as damage. I heard damage. Where did I hear damage? Damage! Okay. Not really in the best position with the silks. So... Ah, that's why. I thought I'd completely raised it up, so I was still heading forward. I don't want to lose out on any cash, so... Let's see if I can point my mast. So it gives me a decent jump, so I don't wet this, this stuff. So, between two ferns is now over. My mast, it's not called the mast, what's it called? My pointy long bit at the end. It's not a stern, is it? I know the thing, like, the thing at the front is called the figurehead. Oh yeah, you get more money for doing these ones. Yeah, because you want to get 700 for... The ones that, oh, do you like my little thing as well? Yeah, palm tree. I don't... I think I'm going to get those silks a bit wet. But... A little bit wet shouldn't matter too much. I can't see because I am now blind. Go west, we are going west. Uh, you know what, I think they actually boost my merchants better as well in Devil's Row. Uh, where did I put the silk? Why 
Why have I got water in my boat? There we go. I picked up a silk, didn't I? Oh, I decided to put it on the end of my boat. It's a good job I didn't go any in the rain. Right. Well, that water didn't appear to affect it, so... We're good. 1,400. That's double what I was getting for the silks before. And it's, it is, it's taking me up in, why was I doing those other ones? Devil's Row is where it's at. Now I have to be careful. I can't fall because I don't want to damage these because I'm pretty sure the rum you usually get the most money for. <coughs> Oh no, it's just the same. So the points you get a grand, and those you get 1,400. It's just a pity, I can't believe I'm saying this, it's a pity it was only five instead of seven. Maybe that's how they even it out. The other ones you do seven things, whereas Devil's Roar you do five, but... <laughs> what are the odds of having two bloody gunpowder barrel ones at the same time <laughs> yeah that's why I killed them if one of them blew up it'd just completely destroy all of them yeah I shot the first gunpowder barrel and then I headshotted the second guy Gunpowder barrels are good for selling, like if you get the stronghold ones, but terrifying to take from one place to another. Because one cannonball will set it off, and one, gunpowder, one stronghold gunpowder barrel can sink your vessel. So. What have I got here? A confounding vault locked by sneaky Devil's Kiss Davis. Use the Golden Wayfinder to deliver to Devil's Roar to recover the key to an ancient vault. I'm saving that when I'm playing with people because it, they're quite hard. A lucrative voyage awarded to pirates who were unable to set sail. So valuable. Only one can be owned at a time. I'm saving that as well. Do I hear cannons? I know I heard cannons. Where the hell was I hearing cannons? Yeah, that's creepy. Is that boat thing still in the sky? Yeah, it's over there. But I shouldn't be hearing things that are happening all the way over there, so... God knows. God knows! Strings, but it's true. Right, just for you, Pixie. 
Oh my god. There's a fair few. And there's multiple stages to these. Right, so let's have a look. We have Sunken Grove. We have Lone Cove. We have Cannon Cove. We have Shipwreck Bay. And we have Chicken Isle. Let's get rid of that. Uh, it's a crooked mass. I can't remember if that was one. Lake of Last Words. I don't remember that. That seems new. Or newer. Snake Island. Chicken Isle. That was one. Uh, uh, Lone Cove was one. Cannon Cove was one. No, it wasn't Lonely Isle. Lone Cove is one. That's three. What's this one? Cannon Cove I've marked down. Shipwreck Bay. And Sunken Grove. Shipwreck Bay and Sunken Grove. Shipwreck Bay and Sunken Grove. Shipwreck Bay and Sunken Grove. They smell like harvest cookies. I think I am actually blind. I've probably passed them already, huh? Shipwreck Bay and Sunken Grove. I mean, Chicken Isle is going to be the first one because I think that's the closest. <coughs> Shipwreck Bay, Sunken Grove. Shipwreck Bay and a Sunken Grove. Shipwreck Bay, Sunken Grove. Right, so, right, zoom out a little bit. No, no, I want to see the names. So, I'm going to head Chicken Isle, and then I've got Cannon Cove, Long Cove, and Sunken Grove, and finish on Shipwreck Bay. And then. I can head to Ancient Spire. Right, so we're starting off, we're going west. Go west! <laughs> Let's go west, because I said so. Go west. I am kind of a hoe. Go west. Go, oh yeah, I like that. Go west! For we have a quest, go west, cause we have a quest, go west, cause we have a quest, go west. Just, I'm going west. Stop moaning at me everyone in my head. And then we drop the sails. Hoist the colours. Hi, Eve ho, thieves and beggars, never shall we pie. Because that'd be weird, you shouldn't put sailors in a pie. Decker, hello, hello Decker. Hi, how's it going? It's going very well, how about yourself Decker? 
Hope you're having a nice day. Good. Oh, good. I can wiggle my steering wheel. Wiggle, wiggle. So Stephen spoils there. So that must be chicken oil, isn't it? I think. I don't need a map. I am the captain of my vessel. And you will not tell me what to do, Pixie! <laughs> what are you doing right now? Uh, we're doing one of my Order of Souls quests, because... Uh, I need to level up Order of Souls as well as Merchant to get to Pirate Legend. Oh no, that's Snake Island! How did I go so wrong? Oh, it's the next island. Carry on going west! But yeah, I'm still on the journey towards Pirate Legend and I'm still trying to get the money together to buy the Captain Sloop and Captain Galleon because I have a Captain Brigadier and it's weird typically when I play on my own I don't use a Sloop I use the Brigadier and it is a bit of a faff to do a, bigger, a Brigadier on your own I believe so. Bye bye Snack Island. I'm quite happy. I mean, I wish that this wasn't the one that only had one captain on it. Because this is a really small island, so it's really easy. Sometimes it can get a little irritating. Where you can hear them and it's like, but where are you? Oh, what do we do with a drunken sailor? What do we do with a drunken sailor? What do we do with a drunken sailor early in the morning? Put him in the longboat till he's sober. Put him in the longboat till he's sober. Put him in the longboat till he's sober. Early in the morning. Ah, he What? Evo and up she raises. I like singing when I'm playing on the sea of thieves. I like to sing the old shanties. I like to sing the Chantilly Cream. You know what I'm saying? It's got a Chantilly Cream it up. I've got the cream. I've got the coffee creamer. I've got some sort of cream. Clotted. Ah, oh, I hate clotted cream. Now, I'm going to prepare oneself with some firebombs just in case I have oh, I should probably reload my gun that would be handy yeah 
take the fire bombs just in case I've got to fight some of the gold smeckles. Renown 30. Pitching. You're not going in the. Oh, you are blurred! Wait, uh, barrel, I didn't bring food. I'm there like, yeah, I'm gonna prepare. Don't need food though. Food's for, for prepared people. Who shot at me? Who's shooting at me now? Where are you shooting from? There you are, you smelly poo face. Just because you were bloody plantified. Stop hiding in the bush. I mean, we can all enjoy the bush, but don't hide in it. Right, what are you going to throw at me next? Oh, banana. These are the gold ones. I really thought I'd kill him before he killed me. Oh, bugger. <laughs> eh, it's not too bad. I have to kill all the golden skeletons because I'm putting them out their misery. Poopy poopy bum, bum be poop, poopy bum. Okay. Where are you, skeletons? You're not going to show yourself now. Mm. Uh, take some blunder bombs. Get back on the Island. I just keep missing. Hey, depression. Oh, God damn, no food. You sneaky ragamuffin. I should probably have stocked up with some food and stuff before I came on this journey. Oh no, I originally was just going to do the merchant missions. Yeah, it's not my fault. I blame Pixie. You asked me to, Pixie. You asked me to do this. Yeah, but I didn't know what it was. Well, that's not my fault. I don't want the long boat till you show back. Alright, let's just do this the correct way. 
Where are you? And I'm so sorry. No, come on, walk into the water. Oh, will you stop being a little poo face? What's that, a bait box? That's an ammo poach. Burn then. Uh, I mean, I could, but it'd be a faff. Rogue of the Gilded Age complete. Hey, the captain's out. And I believe these are just ordinary, yeah, ordinary skellies. I didn't miss. I was aiming for the one behind. No, it's the backup dancers that are the bad ones because they got the guns. Once you killed something, it's dead. No, no, no. Yeah. no. If you look, I've done one of the quests so it's come off. No, that's a different captain. That one comes with skelly orders. Hateful bounty skull. Yeah, sometimes you just find random captains on islands. Yeah, the skulls you get from killing captains. Did you not know that? <laughs> oh, yeah. yeah, that's that's what your skulls are coming from. And yeah, but the ones, the captains that you just randomly find, they give you skeleton orders. So it's, there's a treasure on this island. I'm here anyway, I might as well pick it up. So you get like little treasure map like that. 
So the treasure is right next to that palm tree in front of me. Right, Heather. That's a different school. I've never had that before. A ritual school. Cool. Those must be part of this ongoing event or something. I've never had a ritual school before. But I must say... To be or not to be? That is the question. I'm sorry, I couldn't help myself. Oh no, I don't want to put you on the floor. I want to put you there. What's this? Can I bury? Oh, it's because I've got the spade on. Right, so... My food is okay. Uh, cannons are loaded, so... What did I work out was the next island? Let's take that off. No, oh, there we go. It's up in it. So, relatively north till I get to Twin Groves. And then after Twin Groves, it's northwest. Cannon Cove. Uh, we're heading up to Cannon Cove now for the second bounty. Actually, I should check that I don't crash into this island. Cannon Cove. Jesus, four captains at Cannon Cove. Right. So what I'm going to do... I'll be right back. I'm just going to quickly nip to the toilet. So be right back, guys.
and I'm back. Oh. I'm not sure. How are the seas? Eh, uh, quite calm really. And Cold Moon. Cold Moon, that's a cool name. Uh, hello. How are you, Cold Moon? So, we're heading to Cannon Cove, where we're going to fight four captains. And... Didn't really give me a hint. Kind of hoping they're like the Shadow Captains. I hate the gold ones. They're a bit of a faff. We're heading north! No need for thanks. You've got a cool name. <laughs> I like it. Cold Moon. It's good as well because it's very, um, what's the word? Memorable. Do you play Sea of Thieves, Cold Moon? Oh no, I'm heading north. I'm going to have to go through the wilderness. I'm going to make it through. Ah. That's good. I like the rain. It reminds me of a typical summer in Britain. <laughs> yo ho and up she rises. Yo ho and up she rises. I was aiming for something that's easy to remember for both me and the streamers. Too often I see too many people with convoluted names that just get lost in the static of hysteric chat going 300 miles an hour. Yeah, I can completely understand. Oh, I can completely understand that. But you definitely picked a very good one. Reaper's hideout. Where's Reapers? I can barely see. And yes, I play see a It's cool. What do you think of it? It's me personally, I love anything that puts me on a boat on the sea. If I could do it in real life, I would. I, I love, I love water, the ocean. Oh, it's just. If heaven is whatever your dream place to be is, my heaven will be an endless ocean. I kind of love-hate relationship. <laughs> I have a kind of love-hate relationship with this game. So, I kind of need to ask. Is the hate part of it, when you're trying to do a mission, and then someone just decides to come over and be like, No, no, I want to ruin your day. Oh, what the hell? The Alliance of the Salty Tormentors. What the hell? Uh, what on earth have I stumbled across? Ah, uh, hails to the now. I, I, I've got a mission to do. Yep. That's the world event. You walked into the world event. Yay! I love walking into things like that. It's like when you randomly walk into someone's house and there's a party going, it's like, yeah! It's not a home invasion if it's friendly. <laughs> he has been lucky so far. Just keep sailing until you get out of there, aggro zone. Yeah, I'll probably I'm going to. I mean, it's only a sloop, but it's the Alliance, so... Uh... I know for a fact it's going to be more, and I'm really not prepared for a scrap. I like to load up with cannonballs and potentially have a crew. So, <laughs> go away. I'm not into buying your cookies, you wilderness girls.
It's annoying, I'm going to have to sail away and then figure out right, where, where's the island I was heading to. Go away! I'm a peaceful individual. I don't want to ruin your day. Too high, too high, I'm always aiming too high. Hit something. Oh, they're hitting. Oh, there's a rock! They hit the back of my boat. Am I leaving your area? Yeah, music stopped. Oh god! Damage now. Well, my goal was to try and not have too much damage to the ship. No, I'm pressing the wrong way. There we go. Alright, let's. Get my composure back. So I need to head west. Oh, uh, but is that going to put me back in the line of fire? Kind of want you to disappear and go away a little bit. Can someone else on the server just like take their attention? That doesn't need fixing. That doesn't raise anchor. That's fine. I feel I felt like I took more damage than I did. Yeah, I have to go west. So, I suppose I could always just go, like, north a little. Go north and then start heading west. So, Cold Moon, have you managed to get to Pirate Legend yet?
Yeah, been on for a while. Well, you probably won't believe it, but I've been on Sea of Thieves since it first came out. But it was it was one of them. I always put all of my effort into doing what other people wanted to do. And I mean, I'm close, but I just never sort of paid attention to Pirate Legend. And I missed out on some of the best events as well, like when they first introduced the Meg. I was gutted because I was playing something else at the time. Right, so... map. Yeah, if I keep heading just the way I'm going, I'm going to get to Cannon Cove. I should skirt them for a bit. Wait a minute, where's depression gone? Have I lost depression? Depression, you're not supposed to be there. Oh no, I don't want to sit there. So, this is depression. She's a sweetheart. She loves cuddles and, and stroking. Good depression. <laughs> So, I know my day is going to be a good day if I stroke my depression before I start. <laughs> and, I mean, oh god, what's this? Is that a Meg? Which one is it? Oh, I've done that one. Have I? Is that Crested Queen? Get closer so I can see which Meg you are. Yeah, I'm pretty sure you're Crested Queen. Yeah, it's still right on target. Rum runner aisle. Pretty sure that's Crested Queen. So yeah, I'm I'm pretty close to Power Legend. So at forty six. Good and depression, two things I never thought I would hear in the same sentence. But don't you think my depression is good and cute? It, my depression is the best depression there is. <laughs> no one can change my mind. Anything better than my depression is when I used to play uh, Red Dead 2 because my horse was called Ebola. And my Ebola was the cutest Ebola on the planet. Fair enough, you can keep the tat tile. I don't want that tile. <laughs> oh, oh, oh no. Be friendly. I'm not here to cause a fuss. I'm here to do some quests. I'm not big on Reapers. Well, at the moment. I'm not trying to hurt nobody's feelings. Yeah, I think you're just going to sail away. Come sail away. Come sail away. Come sail away with me. Wait, is this actually the right island? I didn't check. I'm going to assume it is. 
Oh, how close can I get to this pier? Perfect parking. And this is the right island. And let's just go up here and make sure that that ship's bug enough. As a Sea of Thieves veteran, I can say one thing that is actually not mentioned as often as one would suspect. Diplomacy is a weapon and a tool. Definitely. I tend to, if I come across some, like, in a sloop, especially if I'm in a bigger ship, what I tend to do is I'll get close, not very close, but close to their vessel with either, like, a little treasure or... Uh, a pineapple if I've got them just to show them that I'm being friendly so don't be afraid to talk to other ships to see what the end goal is yeah I don't do that enough but then again I have been one of those pains in the bottom players before now and I have just gone over hunting people but only when I've got the Oh, what's it called when you get that special flag emissary? Only when I have the Reaper's emissary, so people kind of know that's what I'm doing at that time. I never do it without that, funnily enough. Maybe I'm just a nice person. Unless it's a galleon. And then I, I'm never usually di diplomatic with galleons, because... It's a galleon, and I'm in a smaller vessel. No, star, 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 star. Well, I don't know what that says. I think I got my ship in a decent enough place so that I could quickly get back to it in case. But. It looked like they were just leaving the island when I came over anyway, so... They're probably doing something similar to me. Let's get on the other side of this island and just peep out. It's not the end of the world if they're aggressive. Yeah, I think they've bugged off. I think the one that I find least trustworthy is when you're at an outpost and someone just comes over and starts playing music. What the hell? I must have got glitched. Yeah, when you're at an outpost and you're offloading your stuff and someone comes over just playing music and then gets on your boat without an invitation, it's like, I mean, I would have invited you, but now I'm kind of wary of you because I don't know what your intentions are. So, I need to find out where these skellies are going to start spawning in. Plenty of food on the island though, so I'll probably eat a little. Isn't there an ammo box around here? There we go. Right. Don't make it so you're miles and miles away. Believe it or not, reapers aren't even the scariest thing in this game. Uh, I mean, I get that, but I'd like to know what you think is possibly the scarier thing in the game. Cold Moon? Because, I mean, it's, a very, it's very likely you know more about this game than me.
the absolute scariest crew are merchants and full galleons of fishermen. No, I don't think I've come across anything like anyone like that. But merchants. I can I can kinda of get that. I'm just gonna stay away from merchants then. Oh wait. Oh that's my boat. I do <laughs> I'm like, oh wait. I feel like I'm pretty safe. Hey, Decker, you're back. How you doing, Decker? Skelly's going to start appearing. Oh, it'd be nice if it was in here. I've always wanted to have a scrap in here. Merchants are scary because they actually have stuff to protect. Oh man, if you break their rum bottles or wet their precious silks, their... I can't see that word. Tra oh, <laughs> track you down. Even if you switch servers. Yeah? Is it only me? What did he say there then? Right, I kind of guess that's what he was saying. <laughs> or they were saying, I don't know. Yeah, it's just me. I'm, I'm just stupid. I've set it up wrong. I can get that because I've been doing a fair bit of merchant's quests and it's like, you mess with my rum or my silk, and I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna hurt you. <laughs> I'm gonna write a mean letter to you, a strongly worded letter. So, nah, I completely understand that. Where the bloody hell are they gonna start? I'm gonna have a look on the map to check the island, see if there's any clear points. That I imagine they would start showing up. Come to think of it, and there we go. So I'm at the pier. I mean, round there maybe. Oh, Decker. Good, just about to get on Sea of Thieves. Cool. And full galleons of fishermen is scary because nobody actually plays Hunter's Call. So if you see a galleon where the full crew is dedicated to fishing, you can be sure that most likely all of them are veterans that literally did everything else in the game on an hour only grinding Hunter's Call. <laughs> Because that is the last thing to do for him. That's a very good point. <laughs> I will say, like, slightly on topic of what you said there, Cold Moon. Um, the fishing in this is quite fun. I quite like the fishing. But Hunter's Call, I mean, I imagine, even if you went, like, full, oh, right, I'm going to try and build up Hunter's Call, I imagine it takes forever. Sma! You right, Sma? How you doing?
Well, isn't that a nice reaction to my presence? Oh, dude, I'll always react like that. You're the captain, man. I've got to, I've got to make you feel welcome. Captain Smart. Right, check that. Is it a loud what? Is it a loud what? I haven't seen any of that. And what's wrong with me kissing ass a little bit, Smart? I mean, it's kind of expected. Where the hell are these skellies? It won't let him see any words that might be slightly Needs offensive for him. Needs to, Needs turn, to it turn it off. I need to figure out how. I don't know how to turn it off. Right. Can you turn you it off? Turn it off. I can fix it for you. Okay. You can fix it for me. When you allow all these words, it won't let them in anyway. Right, so allow. Oh, so you can I'm allow. allowing them all. Right. Smile, you once again you're being an absolute legend, being extremely helpful. So if he if he writes these and I just allow them, hopefully it'll work. <laughs> We've got no clue. I've only been on Twitch for what a week. I'm I'm, I'm getting there. I will get better. I will definitely get better. I just see stars. Uh, I didn't go over this way. I don't know if I want to spam your chat with profanity. <laughs> oh, you can spam my chat with whatever you want, dude. We're going to have to look at the settings. I'm pretty sure you've just... Can you not turn the thing off? I'll be on the I content. tried looking at it, and I just don't. Isn't there a I cave? I'll give you a step by step. Oh, smile. Dude, you, you're just a sweetheart. You're extremely helpful and very lovely. <laughs> what? He said, fuck, I'll stop being nice or I won't help you. Oh, uh, <laughs> stop being nice altogether. See, that didn't show up at all in my chat. For me. Right, let's edit stream. It's not edit stream info. Right, I'm trying. It, it's not edit stream info. Right. Bear with me, peeps. Create a dashboard. Settings. Settings. Moderation. Moderation and then auto mod rule set level one. This is 
No filtering. Move. A little moderation. Turn off auto yeah, mod? Auto mod off. Auto mod off. Yeah. Save. Did my last message come through or is talking? Did my last message come through? I saw that message. I think I've fixed it. Did you see it? No, that's stars again. What? I've turned auto mod off. But I, ah, I can't see it on the. Wait, just let me refresh the tablet. Right, it's just, it's like just the... right, bear with. <laughs> Bear with, bear with, bear with. <laughs> What's the issue? Fuck. Right, yeah, I've sorted it, I've sorted it, I've sorted it, I've sorted it. I think Cold Moon had something to say, but it's all sorted now. Thank you, Smur. What were you saying, Cold Moon? And thank you, Smur. Right, let's get back to trying to find these. Yeah, I had my Autobot thing to custom and I have no idea what it was set to. Thanks, Smur, we are both fecking up useless. I wouldn't say we're useless, inexperienced. I'm going to say it in a nice way. Yeah, just me. I'll get there, I'll get there. I'm trying. Is there a cave around this island that I can find these skellies? I've got four captains to fight. I can't find a single bloody monster uh, skelly. Your job to know this stuff hits it. <laughs> That's very true. And I've said this to Pixie before. It, it, it is. I spent your entire stream on It's just me being an idiot. So, what were you saying before? Oh, there we go. By the way, I have discovered something recently. Are you... Yes, I am soloing at the moment, Smar. And Cold Moon, what was it you recently discovered? Um, yes, ma, I'm trying to get to Pirate Legend, but eh, it's not too well. Yeah, it gets it's a bit of a pain when you're trying to do a quest and you get attacked, and it's like ah, I got to steer the vessel, I got to also attack, got to repair the ship, but I manage. It's not that I don't have any shipmates, it's just I haven't found a crew worthy of my captaining, Smar. <laughs> oh god. No, 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 don't trap me. No, why are you trapping me? Yeah, you're right, I don't have any shipmates. I do, I mean, my brother sometimes comes on and plays it with us, but. He's... Well, he says he's always in charge, but he makes me steer the boat. So you're not even captain then? No, he makes me steer the boat. He makes me do everything. Wait, he... I will be captain. If you want to have actual chance of winning at PvP hourglass thing... And it's best to do solo because then the game will actually match you with people of your actual skill. 
uh, level. But as soon as you invite somebody on the crew, they will give the the game will get all confused and match you against PVP gods without fail. I feel like I could take down a PVP god with my uh, my crew of one. I mean, I thought only PVP gods went into PVP because otherwise, how does it <laughs> judge your skill level? Hmm. It's not like they have anything to base your ELO or MMR off. Yeah, that's true. What should I name my boat? Ooh, naming your boat. That's a tricky one. Uh, well, my my vessel. Uh, that's cap my captain vessel that I've named. Name it Sun Susan Suckass. Kiss my ass, Pixie. <laughs> well, my brigadoon that uh, is named is called Alucard's Rhapsody, and that's purely I just took a character from an anime I liked and put a word with it that sounded nice. So, uh, I mean, that's a good thing you could do for a name. Just think of something you, a character or something that you like. The dancing Molly. That's cool. I like that. The Suspicious Susan would be a good one. Sma, they judge your skill level over your win-loss ratio. So if you have more people on your crew, it seems like the pool, the, that pulls together and you actually take on much more competent crew than yours. Royal Fortune. The Flying du Dutchman. There's already a flying Dutchman in the game, though, isn't there? People might get confused and think you're the vessel that you're supposed to take. Because you can take hold of the skelly vessel, can't you? And captain it while you're on the server. Right, this is getting annoying. Where haven't I been on this island? Is it going to be up there? Happy adventure. Wait, you can do what now? You lost. Are you lying to me? I lost. Who lost? I'm not lost, sorry. Uh, I got confused with what you said. I'm not lost, it's... Um, I've got an Order of Souls quest on this island, but I can't find where the skeletons are, are going to spawn in. Because they spawn in, you fight a few waves, and then you fight all the captains. Follow the music. Is who lying to you? Oh, the Flying Dutchman! No, the, the Flying Dutchman is a skelly galleon that um, if you get on it and kill the captain, you can captain it on the server. I don't know if it's still a thing, but it was. So follow the music. The music's getting louder over this way. Yeah, I've fought the Flying Dutchman in this game a few times, and it's it's not fun. They could be in the cave too. That's what I thought, but I went in the cave before, and unless there is another cave that I've forgotten about. But the music's gone. Music's coming back. Is it down here? No, the music's gone again. Oi. Could be up there. I know they have been up there for me before. But I can't remember how I get up there. Listless, woo! On this island, only one crew. Yeah. Oh, it's a story. Yeah. Uh, 
hunting. There are a bunch of caves on this island, I believe. There is, isn't there? I knew there was more than one. But I know I have done an Order of Souls quest on this island before, and it's been up top that I've had to get. But it's trying to remember how you... What's the easiest way of getting up there? Is it with the cannon? I'm just going to try with the cannon. I'm going to fire myself up there. But yeah, the thing I was saying before was this. What do you mean I can't captain it? Oh! You can captain it. You can take control of it if you can if you kill the captain. Let's just empty some water out of this boat. And let's try and aim it. Out there. Ka Nope, not high enough. Fishing crews don't joke around. Yeah. Fishing crews are usually veteran players that are just trying to build up the hunter's call. That is something I will never forget. I'm going to be mindful of fishing crews. I need to go higher. Bum. Bum. Not that, not too high. Oh, come on, come on, come on, grab, grab. Where am I? Oh, for pity's sake, I'm right next to the floor. Uh. You cannot captain the flying Dutchman. The only time you can board the Dutchman is during a tall tale. Oh, I could have sworn you could captain it. Come on, I was so close. No, it's a tall tale. Oh. Wait, didn't you see that big paragraph I sent just before that message? No, I didn't. I wonder why that didn't come through. Yeah, yeah, I'd never ignore a, a comment off you, dude. Sorry it didn't come through. There we go. Yeah, but it's, it, even if it's a big paragraph, it shouldn't make a difference. God forbid you are tucking on a galleon fishing crew and you decide to munch on their cooked fish and store them back in their storage. So once they return, they see half eaten cargo. Oh man. <laughs> if you do that, they will track down your damn IP address and invade you actual, your actual home. That's what I was trying to send. Uh, yeah, I'm not going to do that. I don't want to get all involved in that. Did someone just throw something at me? They'd have to, they'd have to go through. Yeah, they'd have to go through the dreaded pixie. <laughs> I feel like something just threw something at me. Is there something in here? Am I blind? 
Why is this proving to be such an absolute pain? Uh, if you do that, they would, yeah, blah, blah, blah. you got hit by lightning. Ah, oh, right. That's just me being an idiot. No, it's not here. It is probably at the top of the island. The very peak. You reckon? That's a faff. I shouldn't have come down. Should probably just make sure there's not too much water in here. Uh, there's quite a fair chunk. They are by the east beach, from what I heard. They will never be at the rock peak. Ah! Oh. Okay. That's two different opinions. <laughs> Let's try the East Beach. I can read. I haven't read anything wrong. Yeah, you're right. I should probably check all these beaches. That's a good point. Have you actually? Oh, yeah. I'm going to check all the beaches. Checking all the beaches. Oh, yeah. Is there a North Beach? Ow! <laughs> Why am I stuck? Yeah, I think it might be bugged. I mean, it could be bugged because of that other ship being here. Well, does it increase your odds of being hit by lightning? Yeah. Irritatingly, as well. I've done it before when I've been going around the island several times and all of a sudden I've just gone somewhere really close to where my ship was and it's like, oh, now they're appearing. Which, I mean, I'd be rather annoyed if that happened. Because it would mean I've wasted all of your time. Oh no, because they're, they're watching as well. <laughs> well, I'm just going to check up here. If they, if they don't pop up around here, near this fire, then I've been everywhere, so I will just sail away. I mean, I've got a couple of islands to be get cracking on with. At least the storm's disappearing a bit. Yes, there was. 
I think that that other ship being nearby might have stopped. So yeah, I'm gonna sail away. I'm gonna. S yeah, I think that's probably what's gone on. So I'm gonna sail away. I'll go crack on with another uh, one of my quests. I might do the other three and then just come back to this island because there's an outpost relatively close to this. See, just all really nice, helpful people, really, aren't you? It's not true what I've said about you. I mean, I didn't say anything about you. <laughs> 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 oh, I've got an indoor pool! That won't do. Out of my rats getting wet. I like my rats dry. I like my rats like I like my humour. Dry and occasional squishy. Okay, let's just dump that crap in there. Yeah. So, we'll leave this island. It's still marked. Uh, north, past Lonely Isle, Lonely Isle. And I said Lonely Island. And then it would be north by north, northwest. Uh, no, north by north, northeast. Do 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 And we're turning around the boat. We're oh no, we're going to head closer to the storm that we've just escaped. I'm not going west. I'm oh, oh no, I'm heading north through the wilderness. You know I made it through. Uh, oh, what do we do with a drunken sailor? What do we do with a drunken sailor? What do we do with a drunken sailor early in the morning? Yeah, hey, and up she raises me, hey, and up she raises me, hey, and up she raises early in the morning. Put him in the long boat till he's sober, put him in the long boat till he's sober, put him in the long boat till he's Stop sober, early in the morning. <laughs> shave his belly with a rusty razor, shave his belly with a rusty razor, shave his belly with a rusty razor, early in the morning. Yo ho and up she raises yo ho and up she raises yo ho and up she raises early in the morning. Put him in the bed with a captain's daughter, put him in the bed with a captain's daughter, put him in the bed with a captain's daughter, oh, captain's daughter early in the morning. Way hey and up she raises, way hey and up she raises, way hey and up she raises early in the morning. <laughs> <laughs> is there any more verses? I can't remember. Is there any, is there any more verses to us? I hope there's more. It's a good song! Yo ho! All hands! Boys! The colors I thieves and beggars never shall we die. David Jones. 
can't remember that one. My hands in the sea. Will you ever smell my feet? Yeah, I can't remember the words though. Kind of messed up because isn't isn't that supposed to be that's that's the music box that Calypso gives to Davy Jones. Yeah. And then she just sort of ghosts him. There's this lone cove. Right, I'm heading the right direction. Cause this one's... Oh no! Lone Cove is where I'm heading! Cool! I mean, there's, there's some there's amazing uh, shanties. And I've got to say, if you want to hear some shanties, you should watch Sma7 on Kick. Because whenever he's on... Uh, see of Thieves, he always comes out with them and they, they're brilliant. You're a fan of a sea shanty, aren't you, Smell? I've heard, I've heard you sing quite a fair few when you were playing with Handsome Jesse. Yeah, Lone Cove. What are we looking for on Lone Cove? Two captains. I feel like Lone Cove's an easier one though because it's it's lonely. It's I think it's I think they're probably a lot of people's go to music. They're just really they're really fun to sing. They're really fun to listen to. And they're really good to drink to as well. Like, oh, what's that band that did an amazing song, which is like a piratey one? Oh, they also did a heavy metal version to Diggy Diggy Hole. Oh, I can't remember the name. Oh, I feel bad. But they've got another one, which is called Drink Up. If I remember it, which is brilliant. Ailstorm. Oh, is that who I'm talking about? We shall sail together. That's going on the list. Oh, come on. Oh, battle complete. That's alright, someone's gone and done that. Now, if I remember rightly, this is a good spot for them to start spawning in. Well, it doesn't look like they're going to today. Huh. Well, it look like If I'm not in the cave. I'll do around here somewhere. I've heard this song before.
Hailstorm are more or less a purely heavy metal pirate band from Scotland. Some of their best songs are... Oh no! Why is that blurred out? I thought we fixed that! <laughs> with... With an anchor and big ship, little ship, among others. Well, I'm definitely going to be listening to more of their catalogue. That was a really cool song. What's that band I was thinking of? Look it up, Pixie. That, I think it's called Drink Up by that band that did. Is it something Rose? Mm. Windrose. Uh, is the song called Drink Up? Oh, here we go. Found them. Oh, brilliant. The shadowy one. Oh, no, you don't. I'm getting rid of you. Oh, what? Oh, the fire. Is it Drunken Dwarfs? Is it not just called Drink? Yeah. Apparently the rarest Megalodon in the game also has its own music. I've never encountered one so I can't say if that's true. Yeah it is. Do you know the name of it? Why does it sound like my boat's sinking? Oh god, I've got a hole in my boat, have I? There's a hole in my bucket, dear Lila, dear Lila. Oh, it's from all the rain. I didn't bother emptying it. Right, let's take some food with me this time so that I don't kill myself off. Shrouded Ghost is the rarest of the five. Shrouded Ghost. Let's see, and there's five of them. Have I got three or four? Oh, uh, you know what? I think I might have killed the Shrouded Ghost. Uh, where is it? Uh, equipment, no. Vanity chest. Uh, the Hungering One, the Shadow Moor, the Ancient Terror, oh, and the Crested Queen. So I've only got the Shrouded Ghost left then. It's insanely rare. Well, I really, 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 really want to do them all. So I'm going to have to, I'll probably, <laughs> I'll probably Google it. Is there any ways to increase your odds? Or just where, is there any like areas that are better places to find it? How have I forgotten where all the skellies were? Shredder Ghost has a 1 in a 2,000 chance or a 0.001% of megs. Uh -huh. See, that just makes me want a killer even more. That sounds... It's like, that'd be a really good commendation. Where the hell were those skellies again? I can't believe I've lost them because I am a little bit of a moron.
Sorry, a not point not not five percent. That's that's nuts. I need I need to kill her. Oh, she called again. Shrouded ghost. Is that the one that's usually in that turns up? Sorry, in the uh, Devil's Roar. No, it can't be because I'm pretty sure I killed the one in the Devil's Roar. These gold. Ah. Oh. Right, now suck it. Let's bunch you all up. Dude, you shouldn't have told me that. Now I definitely have to get it. Oh, yeah, break. What we got here? Normal skellies? What the? Jeez Louise, Papa Jeez! Damn, you really coming for my booty? captains oh why would you make them Did I get them both? No. And die. Alright, let's take you to the water then. Dog pig. Oh, let's go take these to the vessel. That's handy to know. I always thought you, you had to directly hit him. No! Why did I swing? I just swung. Hey. What's up? Meow.
No, no. You threw another firebomb only once all the fires has completely died out. I know, but, you know, sometimes I just like to throw them for the sake of throwing them. Alright, I can definitely harpoon from there. I was worried it would be kind of smelly. So, let's go run around and pick up our skeleton skulls. Uh, I might as well do the orders while I'm here. Wait, I thought there was four captains on this island. Uh, there was four on the island that they wouldn't spawn on. This one only had two. No, I meant to pick up the skull, not the ammunition. You pleb. I don't know, I quite like Order of Souls to be honest. Yeah, I get that. I mean, I feel like. I mean, this might just be me that thinks this. But I feel like, you know how with merchants, as you go along, you end up getting the more interesting merchant missions where you got to follow the trade routes and then you find the, the vessel eventually after you've got all the clues. I mean, it might just be that I haven't done one yet, but I feel like it'd be cool if there was like something similar with the Order of Souls. Oh, oh god. Reading this map at the s yeah, I cannot be asked doing the riddle one. Alright, let's let's go away. Alright, we're gonna head south. Go back to that previous island and see if it's no longer buggy. Oh. I would have thought I would have reached that point by now. Being level 46. Ah, I probably have. These are quests that I've been holding on to for ages. I just realised that, yes, I probably do have the more interesting ones. That's just me being a moron. <laughs> a little bit. And weirdly enough, I've leveled up my Athena a little. I've leveled up my Athena a little bit as well. Nothing for Servants of the Flame or Guardians of the Fortune. Chests of Fortune. There's so much in this game I need to do, it's unreal. Oh, it's foggy. Because you have to buy promotions to actually get more quests. Yeah, yeah, I, I know the promotions thing. I'm up to date with the promotions. Oh my, that's a rock! That's close, rock. Come on, come on, come on, turn, 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 Damn it! Right in the kisser. I mean, you're not wrong.
Uh, oh, well, I'll wait until later then to do those things. Yeah. I just don't want to... Right. It's only like one hole. to head west. Pixie. I'm gonna head west. That's a pity. And... And break turn. No, I mean, it's a pity because it's made the, uh, the Chess of Legends obsolete. That's the only reason I said it was a pity. Huh. Oh, I see Skelly. I think this island was just... Uh, get some food. I think this island was just um, glitchy because that other person was here. Did I just catch them in the wrong place? skeleton. Where the hell are they? This is confusing me. Unless they're in the cave. Yeah. To be honest, I've only just picked up my very first virtual school. I didn't. I don't even understand what they are. 
Very behind the times. Yeah. I mean, I've still got that. I never did when it was popular. I never did that quest when you got to get all the different flames and put the skull on the thing. And I've still got that quest. And yeah, I've got the flames multiple times and just gone and put them down for other people. Where's the two? Two down, three down. Did the last one just not come out. Oh, he died. To be or not to be? That was someone else's question. Have I put my boat in a really awkward position so I can't? Yes, I have. Pardon me. Yeah. Maybe so. It doesn't make the obsolete people much more interested in them for FOFs. I highly contest it since the ambition of Chess of Fortune. Oh! So, we've done three of the five islands now. I think this was a bigger one. Might be another one that has four. I love it when it doesn't give me the bloody... Pixie doesn't understand the terms, people. What is it? F O T H. T D, I mean. What is it? Fortress of the Damned. Oh, right. is it for yeah, it is Fortress of the Damned. That's because when you tried to play it, Pixie, um, you suffered such bad motion sickness, so you couldn't enjoy it. Oh, it's Fort of the Damned. I knew it wasn't Fortress. No, because there are things called fortress instead of fort. Heh! <laughs> that was amazing. Did you see me fly with my sword? She's learning though, guys. She's, try she's, she's learning about the game. She likes the game, but the game doesn't like her because her motion sickness just kicks in so bad with this. I'd hate to see what you're actually like with a real boat. I imagine that'd be hell for you, Pixie. What, would you be more of a, I have to fly? Wait, so what voyage is it I have? I'm not a pirate legend. Uh, can I check my voyages? Ship's log. Milestones. Uh.
Well, let me check them while I've got one on. I've got this one you could check your pirate's log reputation. No, it won't be that. Ship's log. Ah, yes, I think that's it. School of Destiny Voyage. Yeah, but I never did it. Because I planned with my baby brother. He was like, oh, we'll do it together. It'll be fun. And then he went and did his with someone else. And then decided, no, I don't want to play Sea of Thieves anymore for like a year. So I've just kept it in my inventory. So there's a skull that gets rid of the need to spend hours and hours trying to get killed by lightning. So I always found that the light, the flame you get for lightning and the flame you get for PvP were always the ones that irritated me. And sometimes the lightning one is so much easier than the PvP. We're heading east. Eastbound and down. That's a show. Is it? East. Go east for no, some Easter down. eggs. <laughs> Not Eastenders. <laughs> no. Oh, that's, I knew I knew it was from something. There's got to be a song that I'm talking about. I know, I know, I know the perfect song to sing when heading east. You ready? Oh, what should we do with a drunken sailor? What should we do with a drunken sailor? What should we do with a drunken sailor? That's right. Early in the morning. Yo ho and up she rises. Yo ho and up she rises. Yo ho and up she rises. Early in the morning. Put him in the long boat till he's sober. Put him in the long boat till he's sober. Put him in the long boat till he's sober. Early in the morning. Way hey and up she rises. Way hey and up she rises. Way hey and up she rises. Early in the morning. Shave his belly with a rusty razor, shave his belly with a rusty razor. Huh? Oh, that's cool. I mean, all I've got at the minute that I've been keeping on to for a while is I've got one to open an ancient vault for gold hoarders. How is this storm so strong? I'm not near the center. I'm gonna have to bloody repair my boat. Remember they didn't have that popping light. Like. Shave his belly with a rusty razor, shave his belly with a rusty razor, shave his belly with a rusty razor, early in the morning. 
Way hey and up she rises, way hey and up she rises, way hey and up she rises early in the morning. Put him in the bed with the captain's daughter, put him in the bed with the captain's daughter, put him in the bed with the captain's daughter early in the morning. Way hey and up she rises, way hey and up she rises, way hey and up she rises early in the morning. Shave his belly with a rusty razor, shave his belly with a rusty razor, shave his belly with a rusty razor early in the morning. Way hey and up she rises, way hey and up she rises, way hey and up she rises early in the morning. I really like to think, Cold Moon, I really like to think that you were singing along. That tune's going to be stuck in your head now, Pixie. <laughs> Ooh, Shipwreck Bay. Shipwreck Bay's one. I'll go Shipwreck Bay. Shipwreck Bay. <laughs> <laughs> I like it, Cold Moon. I like it. No, I need to swap something else. I need to swap something else. My mother told me one day I will buy panties that are frilly. <laughs> Wait, no, no, singing the wrong version. <laughs> No one would get that. No one remembers Peter Cook and Diddley Moore. Sadly. We only know him because of our dad. Our dad. That made it so much. That's really messed up. Our fathers. <laughs> we, we we have different have dads. That sounded so bad. Our dad. Yeah, we're not. We're not. I think you should just leave the subject yeah, alone now. Shows. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and just think, she's not even drunk. <laughs> Did I leave it too late? No, perfect timing. Now, theoretically, this one should be a bit easier. But I'm just going to quickly nip to the toilet. I'll be, be right back. I will be right back. I'll even put a little comment. Be right back. And I, I love you all.
balls. I can't go to the toilet. <sighs> this is where Pixie performs a mutiny. <laughs> I'm busting, I'm busting, I'm busting. Bonjour. Bonjour. Friendly. <laughs> oh, friendly? Yeah, friendly. Oh, okay. oh, you're not friendly. Sorry, sorry for my friend. <laughs> it's alright. I get it, I get it, I get it. I'm literally just trying to build up my order of souls, dude. Yeah, sorry. Meet them both. Should be able to hear me. Sounds good. Oh, uh, sorry, sorry, fire. Sorry, sorry, fire. Black. Go fudge yourself. to have a little, little. Am I still coming through all right for the rest of you? Pixie struggling to hear me. Has your headset come on, come loose? Yeah, they hear me. I'm on Twitch, not Kick. Kick's later on. Right, where the hell are they? Right, you fuckers are gonna fucking pay for that. I'm pissed now. Fuck you, bitch! I wasn't born fucking yesterday. I really hope that isn't a kid that I've just sworn at. 
Sorry for my language, I'm usually quite a pleasant person. But goddamn, they pissed me off. They incurred the wrath of Aunt Susan. Tell them I'm a friendly one. But it's like, a bear can seem friendly until you poke it in its face. Where are they? Oh, they're still... Where's the active fog? I'm just gonna hunt them down and kill them the good old fashioned way. Uh, I'm I'm angry. Are they coming for me? I don't think they are. See my typical trick, my typical strat. <laughs> I lure them into the storm. I take them in the storm, I just let my wheel do whatever the hell it's doing, and then I just, I abandon my vessel, typically. You should have boarded them and sunk them. I had to go after them. Thing is, is I want to do the quest, and I really need the toilet. Over there somewhere. Are they running away? Are they really that much of a chicken shit? Oh my god, they are being such cowardly individuals. I mean, why would you start shit? Why would you start shit if you're not gonna finish it, you know? I mean, if you're gonna come over here and twist my nipples, I'm gonna come back at you with a full, like, nut grab. Yeah, they're dead. They're dead. I'm, I'm coming for you. Uh, Yoo-hoo! I want to play with you. Let me play. Yoo-hoo! Let me play with you. You poked the bear, now the bear wants to give you hugs. Yes. Yoo-hoo! <laughs> I'm coming for you. Hi. I want to play with your beautiful face. Yoo-hoo! Hmm? Yeah. Yeah, my voice chats on. Where the hell have they gone? Stop hiding! I want to hug your face! I hope I heard that. <laughs> Yoo-hoo! And Susan is coming to wish you Where good you tidings. And students! 
Turn my voice chat off. On. Isn't it? Sort that out. Audio. Crew chat here. Yeah. Player. Watch the top now. Accidentally sailed into the storm. Well, it heard me before. Yeah, they heard me before. Let me make sure my chips are okay. Liked it. I can't find them. Right. See, I, they, they definitely heard me because they replied to me when I said I was friendly. I'll put my indicator on though. Just let me get out of this mess. I love how they come at me once. I start being more active. They shit themselves and run away. King Julian! <laughs> so, smile, you've now heard the Aunt Susan voice. <laughs> Stop here a sec, in the middle of nowhere. Is that broke? Yeah, that's broke. Alright, so let's get on here. Settings. Yeah. Okay, where was it now? Audio. Chat indicator on. Hello. Hello, hello, hello. Yeah, yeah, that's up. Hello. Oh, wait a minute. I think I can see someone.
Hello, I am here to play. I found you, you are hiding. I'm here to play with you now. No more running. Aunt Susan wants to play. Aunt Susan plays hard. Don't be afraid, I'm friendly. I play nice. I'm going to give you big Aunt Susan hugs. Playtime! <laughs> Traumatize them. <laughs> for you three four I'm knocking at your door five six play with sticks seven eight stay up late nine ten never sleep again Aunt Susan's going to get you <laughs> I kind of hope this is the same ship. Oh, did you think <laughs> <laughs> He's got some little kid playing the game and's like, Why is this person tormenting me? I'm pretty sure it's the same ship. Looks like the same ship. I'm, I'm like nine percent so sure. Funny if it <laughs> oh, it could be that one. <laughs> I could just be tormenting some random person. Wait, did, did they have an emissary flag? They've got an emissary flag. It's them. Well, we'll know if it's them if they don't stop moving. I don't think it is that them. <laughs> I think I just attacked a random person. <laughs> I know, I know, I know how to calm the situation. I'm friendly!
Where are my holes? I could just see you getting I'm trying to fight back. Oh no. Killed one of them. They They're rushing. That's not the team. That's not the people. <laughs> That's not the right team. Sorry. Mistaken identity. Hey, hey, wait a minute. Actually, I don't think I attacked your ship. So yeah, screw you. He's <laughs> now on the boat. Stop the boat faster. Stop the boat. Uh, that sounded rusky. Oh, it could just be a Slavic language I've not heard before. Oh, look! All oh, my skulls are dead and gone. It's Russian, yeah. I told me. Well. I think I'll leave that stream there for today. Uh, because I need to eat. I've been streaming for a while now. I hope you've enjoyed, and we're going to find someone to raid. Uh, start raid. I hope you've all enjoyed. And uh, wait. Uh, give Jesse some love. He's a brilliant streamer. I think you'll like his stuff if you haven't seen it already. And he's pretty much the person that. That got me into Twitch and, and Kick. So I hope you like it. I have set up the raid. Is it coming up for you? So let's just. Now for the awkward exit of the stream. No, no, no. No awkward exit. No awkward exit. No, no, no. No, no awkward exit. <laughs> Yeah, Aunt Susan uses raid. And uh, yeah, just everyone give some love to Jesse because he's handsome and he's lovely. Uh, so yeah, here we go. I made a rubble tea instead. Oh, I've got two sandwiches for that. 